Uh oh. Hi. Hi. How are y'all? Good. Good. Oh, wow. This is great. Let me just. What's going on here? Um, we're selling. Um, I made a bunch of cards and they made jewelry. And we're going to give all the money for, to a charity in India to a school that doesn't have simple supplies. And we're going to give them some money so they can have a better school. Well, that's fantastic. I want to talk to you about that a little bit more. Okay. But first, would everyone tell me your name? My name is Mayuri. Mayuri? I'm eight years old. Um, I'm, yeah. Where do you live? I live in Chennai. In, in Asia. India? Yeah. And so, are you, since you live there, are you just visiting here in New York now? Yeah. Wow. Okay. My name is Karina and I'm also from Chennai, India. We're visiting here for our summer break and I wanted to make some money so we could go and give it back to the school so they could have a better life. Oh, that's wonderful. My name is Amna and I'm six years old and I'm selling these jewelries and I'm giving the money to uh, poor schools and... It's wonderful, isn't it? And I live in Chennai. Hi, I'm Leela. I'm I just turned ten a few months ago, and um, I want people in India to have a better life. So I'm giving money to schools and everywhere else. Just to That's people. fabulous. Now the the three younger of you, you you three are you you're all sisters, yes? Yeah, yes. all three of us are sisters. And I. Friend. You're their friend. All right, tell me a little bit about this jewelry. How what did you use to? I didn't make the jewelry. Well, um, we used um wool to make it like pom poms, like like yeah, like string to make it like pom poms. Uh huh. Then um we made, as you can see, we made a little loop here. Then like we made a little opening space. Uh huh. And then we cut the uh, the other parts were also loops, so we cut it with scissors to make it open up like a pom pom. And um, that's a we necklace. Cut, yes, it's a necklace, and we cut a long string. Then, as we said that there's a loop here, we just attach it to the string and tie it at the end. So it's pretty simple to make. Uh huh. And the bracelet, we did the same. It's like a pom pom, but it's like basically like a circle kind of pom pom. Same thing. We tied it to a loop, and we tied it. And we just made it a little smaller, like a bracelet. Like. Oh, that's fabulous. Now, were there? Did you have colors other than pink and red? Um, pink, red, and white. white. You had white, so the white was very popular and went right away. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Did yes. you sell many of the jewelry today? Um, yeah. Yeah. A few, yeah. We have a few. Yeah. Uh huh. So, how much is the bracelets? The bracelets are one dollar. And the uh, necklaces is two dollars. Necklaces are two dollars. Have, have you ever been here to the U.S. before? Yeah, I am born here. You were born here? He was and born I in live. Connecticut. Oh. How long did you stay here? I stayed here, I think, six months when I was born. And how long have been you lived in Chennai? Uh, probably like um, eight years, maybe. Eight years, maybe. All right. So now tell me, look at this also incredible art here. Yeah, um, so I came up with this idea yesterday and I drew a bunch of drawings. I, I like made up these um, funny things and then I am a good artist so I drew a bunch of pictures. And I came out here last night and I sold them. And I came out here today morning and uh, in the afternoon right now. So um, I, I'm gonna, I've made a lot of money so I'm gonna go and give it all to the charity and I hope it makes a better difference. Well, that is great. Tell me um, tell me a little bit about the cards that you chose to draw. Tell me the one about you're so pretty. Um, I just drew this because I thought maybe a husband would give it to her, his wife uh -huh. if he bought it. Can you hold it down so we can yeah. see? Yeah, there's okay. this one. So that's for uh, a husband to give his wife? Yeah. Cool. And, and, or a, a daughter to give to her mom or something. Uh -huh. And then this one is like a best friend would give it to another best friend so that they could say that and then there's also this one for me a best friend. Wow, those are great. And then there's also ones that you can write in from your, for yourself to and from reasons why you're an awesome person and reasons why I love you. 
So you're like, you can give that to whoever you want. Uh-huh. And then this one is just a funny thing. Let's well, have a cuddle. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. And how much are these cards? Just one dollar for all of them. It's amazing. Now, have you ever done anything like this before? Yeah, actually we made a cupcake and lemonade stand in Central Park and we made $61 and we gave it to a charity in India, in the same school in India. When did you do that? In 2011. Wow. And where is the school in India? It's in the southern tip of Chennai. It's in a small village called uh, Kulipide. And do yeah. you speak? Yeah, we speak the language. You that speak Tamil? Yep. Yeah. Uh -huh. And do you speak any Malayalam? No. No. I only speak Tamil. So how long are you all here for for break? Um, we were he uh, here for three months. We came in March. In March. And Beginning of March. And so you'll be going back soon. June seventh. June seventh. Wow. Are you? I'm gonna. I uh, came a couple of weeks ago. Uh, we are staying here for a month. Uh huh. So I leave at um, June 9th or 10th, maybe. Wow. Now tell me, when had you been in school before you went to Chennai? Yes, here in Battery Park City, 276. 276 Battery Park City School. Uh -huh. That's where we used to go for till I was eight years old here. And then we moved to India. And when you got to Chennai, what, what surprised you about India? Well, there's a lot of hustling and bustling, just like here, yeah, but I found some differences. Um, the the, uh, yeah, the currency is different. That's one um, thing. And, it, and uh, the schools are much different, and I had a hard time kind of adjusting to the schools. What do you mean? What what did well, you need to adjust they to? Well, teach like um. The way they teach in the schools um, are very different from here and they don't have the same subjects. Some of them are different. We have like science and math and stuff like that, but it's very different. And we already learned like algebra and stuff that you are supposed to learn in sixth grade here or something like that. So in India, so, you've already learned that? Yes. That's amazing. And what about you? Um, I have never um, learned here before. I, 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 from little I was in India, so I don't, I haven't seen that much of New York, but I know a little bit. Um, in India, there are a lot of differences. Um, the people are different and well, everything is. Do you like New York? Yeah. You're, you're glad you came for these three months? Yeah. That's good. Tell me what your favorite thing about New York is. Um, my favorite thing about New York is um, that I like the coldness here and in India it's actually really hot. <laughs> so this, that, that's a difference from um, the U.S. and also, um, I'm also, um, Sometimes some cars are, there's some other cars that are like, just have different, like, um, different companies and um, different uh, names, like some cars, like, some different names. There are also, uh, so people are different, like, and also, the, and also in India, the, it's, um, there's a bunch of trash on the, trash on the floor. There's a bunch of garbage on the floor and also the beach is a bunch of garbages. A bunch of garbage, so there's like a lot of differences from the US from India. I'm gonna ask you to speak a little louder, but let me ask you since you mentioned uh, garbage on the streets and so forth, do you think that has an effect on their health? Yeah. It could, right? Yeah. Because of pollution. And, and when I'm going back to India, I'm going to put um, garbages, in the, the garbages in the beach and we tell people to put in the garbages. Right. Yeah. And one. Chennai has a nice beach, doesn't it? Yeah. 
And one difference in Chennai that I noticed when I went was, um, uh, what was I going to say? Uh, yeah, the, uh, yeah, the garbage on the, there's a lot of garbage on the street and also compared to here, there's a lot of motorcycles there so it causes more pollution. Right. More pollution and um, but one good thing that I noticed there is that they use a lot of bikes too. So that's one difference that I saw and like she said, um, it was very hard to adjust of not being in the cold after I've lived here for eight years of my life and there for three years. So it was hard to adjust that when I went there because I'm used to here in winter. I was born in January. So and yeah, there's here, no they cold. don't have winter. Yes. There's no so. cold in Chennai, right? Yeah, so that was one <laughs> None. What difference does, did you see between, say, Chennai and New York that you would like to talk about? Um, well, there's a lot of differences, but um, the the schools in India are pretty much the same, like the subjects and everything. But the bill, uh, like the inside the building, there's just it's just tables and chairs, and then a chalkboard, and then uh, a teacher's desk. Like here in the U.S., we would have a smart board in every room instead of a chalkboard, so that's different. And then also. The food, the food is very different too. It's all like um, my mom cooks Indian food at home, and that's what most people do. But there's also Italian restaurants and Mexican restaurants and all kinds of restaurants, just like here in New York. And um, there's also Indian restaurants outside. And we live in a community where there's um, a few, like 17 houses, and there's a gate in the front of it. But a lot of people live in uh, separate houses too which are, um, they're, they're really, in where we live in Chetinad, which is, uh, there's a bunch of small towns there, there's really big houses, and they're very, um, very d beautiful, and they're all, all, like, from a long time ago, so they're all very nice and beautiful because the people, like, decorate it with their own hands and stuff. That's lovely. What would you like Americans to know about India? Um, about the culture and how it how it feels like to live in a, um, our village. Kind of. Well, specifically, what would you like them to know? What would you like them to experience? Um, just like how how it is to live there. It's just much different. It's very different. So. And what would you like your friends in India to know about New York, for example? Um, how it th there's very um, there's also a lot of similarities so I want them to see how it's um, actually like a little bit like here, uh, Chennai and they, they think like America is a really great place like much better than India but then when they come here they might think differently so tell me who you got your artistic ability from hmm? I don't know did you my get it mom, from your mom, mom or your dad yeah my mom my dad is terrible I see. You know one of the things I like about India? What? Is the bright colors. Yeah. yeah every, people don't wear black there. Yeah. Right? Yeah, only for funerals they wear black. You know? Yeah. No, I like the bright colors. Yeah. Have you taken up any Indian classical dance? Or you yeah, dance? actually we, we're studying a dance called Bharatanatyam. It's the classical dance of Chennai or India. And um, we've been learning it for the last like three years. And um, it's kind of like ballet because it's very, um, you have to like be concentrated and it's like really hard work to do it. And we just had a recital actually um, a few months ago in February and we had like like 30 people watching us. So we did three dances and, and then we also had some other people singing Carnatic music. <laughs> um, and tell me, do you sing any, uh, any of you sing? Or yeah. play a musical instrument? Well, well, my mom wants to get us into Carnatic mus music. Uh -huh. And actually, some of our friends uh, go to uh, singing classes with, for Carnatic music. Wow. How about you? No, um, I'm not into singing a lot. But I do like singing. I, like, I, I love singing, actually.
That's great. Well, I must say that you are all charming, and I'm so impressed with your initiative to do this wonderful work and to share and uh, to give to the other children in India. It's really fabulous. I'm so glad I walked down this block today. Okay? Thank you all. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.